Meanwhile, I have just completed a very dangerous assignment. Freeberg, I said to myself, for indeed that was my name. Uh, why don't you get an interview with the abominable snowman? So here then is the interview with one of these dreaded ape-like creatures as I recorded it high in the Himalayan mountains. This is Stan Freeberg speaking high in the Himalaya Mountains in northern India. <clears throat> I'm standing next to this uh, particular uh, uh, gentleman, uh, creature. Uh, just uh, what is it uh, you are there? A little of each, Stan, actually. <laughs> a, little, uh, a little of each, that's right. I see, then you are the abominable... Uh, snowman, that's right. <laughs> Oh, I never cared for that word abominable too much, Stan. You mind if I call you Stan? No, not at all. Well, I never cared for abominable, but it's the nearest word uh, translated from the original Hindustani, which was uh, Abominuya Mayo, <laughs> which means the hairy one with the big feet. Yeah, I can see it lost something in the translation. I was noticing your... Uh... Noticing my sneakers there, were you? <laughs> Quite large. Yeah, what are they, about uh, 12? What, are you kidding? 12? They're size 23. <laughs> That's pretty big. Well, it's functional design, you know. Did you ever try to walk on snow with ballet slippers? Or roller skates? Well, yeah, don't you have a little bit of uh, trouble uh, buying them? I mean... Well, I just can't walk into any old store and buy them. No, I have them specially made up for me. Well, where, where, where do you get them? Well, when I don't have the chance to drop by Abercrombie & Fitch, uh, I send up to Spalding's. They make them up for me. <laughs> I, uh, I have them in four colors, uh, the white, the red, uh, the pink, and the orange. I'm wearing the orange today. Oh, that's very nice. Well, that's the particular ensemble I picked out today. Oh, well, it's not much of an ensemble, is it? I mean, it's just the shoes. Well, it's, it's an ensemble to me, yeah. <laughs> Some of us are, aren't too well off uh, as others. Well, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Oh, that's all right. It's all right? Yes, it is. Okay, okay, all right, all right, fine, fine. <laughs> Just, uh, what is it you do for a living? You, you terrorize the mountain? That's right, I uh, terrorize the mountain climbers who come up here. Uh, that is my trade, and I am proud of it. Is it uh, hard work? Uh, you have to do a lot of uh, training? Well, I don't think everybody can do it, you know. They don't have the hair for it, for one thing. <laughs> <laughs> or the sneakers. Say you're quite tall, you know. What, what are you, about the eight, nine feet? No, I measure in around ten and a half, buddy. Ten and a half feet tall? He, That's uh, pretty tall. You think I'm tall? You should see my brother. He'd jump center for abominable state. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, I missed him. Uh, have you had a, a pretty good day's work today? No, it hasn't been too hard today so far, no. Mm -mm. You, uh, what was that again? Mm -mm. You, uh, you done much uh, terrorizing? No, not too much today. Well, I wonder if you could uh, give us a demonstration before we sign off of whatever it is you do uh, to terrorize the mountain climbers, certainly. Well, uh, well what, do you, what would you like me to do? Well, just turn your back there and close your eyes. Close your little eyes and I sort of uh, sneak up behind you and let fly with one. <laughs> let fly with one what? Never you mind, just turn your back. Well, I think I ever... Never mind, never mind, just turn your back, please. No peeking. All right. Don't you open those eyes now. I won't. All right. I'll just sneak up behind you now, tippy-toe. <laughs> Which is hard with my feet. <laughs> Here I come now. Here... Maybe a little start there tonight, Stanley. <laughs> Say, that white hair is very becoming. <laughs> Sets off your ruddy complexion. Very nice. Gee, that was effective. Well, gosh, I see our time is up. Oh, that's a shame. Sure you don't have time for a quickie before you hit the pike? <laughs> no, I really 
really don't. Well, if you'll forgive me, I got to get back to work. I see a mountain climber over there by the edge. Well, nice meeting you. Nice meeting you, Sam. Nice to see a man happy in his work. 